Now, another bearded gentleman who was obsessed with chirality is James Clerk Maxwell. And around 1871, when he was making the final touch of his supreme theory of electromagnetism, he had a very anxious moment. He realized that there was a problem in his definition of left and right, and there was no proper definition. So, in a meeting of the London Mathematical Society, he gathered his friend, William Thompson at the time, who would become in 1892 Lord Kelvin, uh, Arthur Cayley, the great mathematician, and others, and, says, and said the following. In pure mathematics, little inconvenience is felt from the one of un uniformity. As long as you're consistent from one book to the next, that's fine. But, he says, in all physical sciences, it is of the greatest importance that one or the other system should be specified. And what does he mean by that?